Here that before his ears, that should be there, is not there. But I've realized that, you know, sometimes it is not only the persons who are grieving, bereaved are grieving, that is grieving. Even the individuals who need one. Sometimes you don't even know the right words to say. Sometimes you don't know how to react around the individuals, right? And sometimes because of this kind of, you know, action of how um, you're seen, it seems like you don't care. The support is not really there when really even the person who can honor women in their own way. So this evening, um, I just want to extend our apologies to both the present and the latter families that have lost their loved ones and who in your perception or in your life you did not get that support that you needed or you know that love that should be you know demonstrated and it's left, it has left a uh, bitter stick you know in your hearts this evening i just want to say to you ask for forgiveness right because sometimes it's not intentional but persons are grieving also in their own way and sometimes you don't know what to say you don't know what to say you don't know how to react right so go to families in latter times who have lost their loved ones and go to the present. We just want to ask you to forgive us and we want to, you know, offer our apologies to you and to tell you that you're loved, to tell you that we care, to tell you that you are appreciated. You know, and I hope this evening that our apologies will be accepted that forgiveness will be demonstrated and that you will know that you are not alone you are not alone i was judging some names and so on but i said no i'm just going to speak in general right right i hope that you will understand that we love you dearly we care as the word of god says we want to rejoice with those who rejoice and mourn with those who mourn and sometimes we might not come across the right way but that still doesn't mean that we don't love you and we don't care and i just want to say to you also that you know it hurts when you lose somebody who is dear to you but cherish the good memories that when the difficult times come along you know those good memories will help you to go through them right so as i said before our sincere apologies for whatever hurt we might have caused and you know just to say that it is not always as it looks but just in case because sometimes yes we intend to have that standoff and, you know, it causes hurt. So, that's it from me. Alright?